Hi there, this is Anna from Seven Shifts. We get asked all the time, what is restaurant scheduling? And how do you go about creating a schedule for your restaurant? Today, we're going to fill you in on the top things you need to know about restaurant scheduling and share with you the step-by-step -step method for creating a great restaurant schedule. So, what exactly is restaurant scheduling? Simple. Restaurant scheduling is creating and maintaining a work schedule for everyone that works at a restaurant, including what time they work and in which department or role they will be working. This might sound simple, but it's surprisingly tricky. Restaurants are busy places with many different departments and roles. The challenge for restaurant managers or anyone who creates schedules is to ensure you have enough staff scheduled in each part of a restaurant at the right time to ensure that service isn't affected. So how do you create a great restaurant schedule? Here's a step-by-step -step process to creating your schedule. The first thing you need to consider is what type of business you run. A coffee shop's shift schedule, just like their hours of operation, will differ wildly from a full-service restaurant. The first step in building any schedule is to outline shift hours. Note that these hours will often be different than your operating hours to account for prep and cleanup time needed before and after open hours. When scheduling, you have to consider availability. Employees and their personal lives will affect when and for how long you can schedule them. After you outline the shift hours, the second step is adding employees into your schedule. And be sure to account for their individual availability, time off requests, other jobs, or things like holidays and labor restrictions that may be in effect. Adding staff availability to your scheduling process will also ensure that you don't accidentally schedule someone who's unavailable to work that day, saving you from a headache down the road. The third step is to plan out how many staff need to be scheduled at different times throughout the day in order to meet your expected demand or to fall within your labor targets. For many managers, this is done based solely on intuition, but if you want to be more precise, you can reference past sales data from your POS to see how many staff should be working. Online scheduling tools like 7Shifts make this easy by integrating with your POS so you know exactly how much your labor spend will be as you build your schedule. Make sure you stagger shifts to cover the time between shift starts and ends. It's important to include shift overlap in case an employee is late or there are unforeseen problems. Use a scheduling tool with a day view option to check that you have the shift overlap that you need. When it's all planned out, fill out each shift so that there's ample coverage all day, publish your schedule, and share with your staff. Web-based scheduling tools will notify your staff automatically that there is a new schedule available and what shifts they work. This is the basic way to build a simple restaurant schedule. As the restaurant scales, so does the scheduling complexity, but these steps are a great place to start. As you can see, creating your restaurant schedule can be simple when you work through creating it step by step and use tools that make it easy to make updates when things inevitably change. And that's the final tip. Expect the unexpected. Restaurants are busy places and the schedule is always changing. The easier it is for you to make changes to your schedule, the easier your life will be. If you would like to learn more helpful how-tos, watch our other videos, or visit us at sevenships.com. See you next time.